So this is an example to find out if two events are independent. In this case, we happen to have um, an experiment where we're rolling two dice. So as a reminder, the sample space for rolling two dice is one, 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 two, one, three, all the way to six, six. To determine if two events are independent, you have to look at if the probability of A given B equals the probability of A. If they equal, then that means B happening doesn't actually change the probability of A happening, which means the events are independent. Um, then first thing to do is figure out which event is A and B. It doesn't matter, so you can just let A equal one event and let B equal the other. So well, let's let A equal the sum of 6 and let's let B equal that the first dies of 4. So to find the probability of A given B we have to look again at the concept of a restricted sample space. If you do an A given B then you know that B has actually happened and so looking at event B, event B is that the first dies of 4 and the way that that can happen is um, you can get a 4 1, a 4 2, a 4 3, a 4 4, a 4 5, and a 4 6. Now, out of this restricted sample space, the way to get a sum of 6 is just this one outcome here. So there's one way to have this happen out of 6 ways of anything happening. So the probability is 1 out of 6. Now let's look at the probability of getting just a sum of 6. So the event space for getting a sum of 6 would be getting a 1, 5, a 2, 4, a 3, 3, a 4, 2, and a 5, 1. So that means that out of these events, which there are, um, this event space, there are 5 outcomes in this event space. Out of 36 outcomes in the total sample space, so that would be 5 out of 36, which actually doesn't reduce so one of the things we notice in this problem is that the probability of A given B does not equal the probability of A. So that means that these two events are not independent, and you can either say they're not independent or they're dependent. So we'd say the sum of 6 and first dies of 4 are not independent. And that's all there is to it.